National Automotive Design and Development Council is seeking better support for the growth and development of Nigeria's auto industry. It says the industry has great potentials which can only be fully harnessed with adequate support needed for its announcement. Lara Falayo reports. Nigeria's Automotive Industry Development Plan, also called the Auto Policy, was announced by the authorities many years ago. It is designed to stimulate investments on local auto production and encourage indigenous assemblage of cars. The policy is now being reviewed and the automotive authorities say the process has been finalized and the document would soon be sent to the legislature as an executive bill for passage before onward movement to the president for executive assent. The document is seen as having the ability to reposition the country's automobile industry. And the NAIDP came in, pioneered by the NADDC, and today we have over $1 billion invested in the automotive industry. All you have to do is take a short trip to Lagos, Ogun, Aquanibo, Kaduna, Kano, and see the huge investments that these prominent companies have made. The Automotive authorities also seek support from all stakeholders towards seeing an expansion of indigenous car assemblage and, by extension, local car production. Yes, the automotive sector has problems. Yes, Nigeria as a country is facing challenges. But I believe that both private sector and the government are working very hard to see that these problems are solved. Operators in the country's auto industry seek that the environment be made more conducive for their businesses. They particularly want assistance by way of forex availability and lament that competing with other car brands imported into the country has not been easy. One is in the area of forex. Now, because we, 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 are, we assemble, we are like a manufacturer. Before it was 10%. Now they have raised it to 35%. Down with all this, or uh, some other company bringing in the, the the product, the same one. We are in the same market, so they they are not supposed to be competing with. But now they are competing because the the market is more cheaper for them because at their own rate. The country's automotive authorities have introduced electric cars into the market to, amongst other reasons, deal with associated problems of fossil fuel. They also believe that the introduction of fiscal and non-fiscal incentives will help drive the production and sustainability of electric cars production in the country. Lara Folayo, TVC News, Abuja.